ሄደ አዝኛው ብቻ የሆኑ ከተባለ ያኛውን ክሎዝ ማድረግ ነው ደግነው ወደ ደግነው ብቻ አሁን ደስ ልጋች ማር ብቻ ማ total area is 7000 hectare uh, that's being uh, irrigated and the number of households involved in this are like between 10 10 11000 households so, so by, by implication there are about 50000 people who are supported by this uh, project በተለያየ ነገር ማለት በቤታቸው ላይ በቤታ ያያዛቸው በኑሮ ደረጃቸው በአመጋገባቸው ባለባበሳቸው ብዙ ቼንጅ አለ Now what I'm saying is there are uh, co- concrete improvements in terms of uh, nutrition, how they dress, and household uh, uh, standard of the house, of the house uh, themselves and, and so on. And uh, there is a lot of cash circulating in this area. And uh, as he explained to us, there is a main dam upstream and there is a primary canal which is uh, like 20 kilometers long. And from that main uh, primary canal there are secondary canals which leads the water to dams like this and from these dams and there are outlets which lead to the tertiary canals and then is the quaternary canals and the field canals um, because the irrigation the infrastructure the canal system is about eight eight hundred kilometers of this kind of complicated uh, canal system so this has to be managed every year and um, both to let the water flow but also uh, to for farmers to be able on the other end to to be able to get the water there is a group of farmer farmers who they elect uh, their leaders and that person is responsible to organize them and schedule time when this canal should be you know cleaned up uh, who should get uh, water for how which day how much of water things like that i'm studying how these institutions and organizations are developing uh, we are talking about five years and farmers are learning uh, how to cooperate how to manage this canal system but gradually the idea is for farmers to take over all those uh, facilities the major uh, contribute financial contributor for this one is the african development bank but the government has also its own share um, original zero is an idea of recovering the cost uh, from the farmers but it, that hasn't yet started i mean farmers are very aware about this and they are very willing to pay the, um, op- the maintenance and operation costs the irrigation is, scheme has given them also the opportunity to introduce some of these crops they were they weren't used to this kind of crops in this area like wheat even maize as according to toacho some of the crops will be harvested a bit quite in, in a couple of months then they can plant immediately with the irrigation and they can produce on some of the fields twice so there is this kind of shift and um, a configuration of crops you know when to plant what to plant here and they know what what crops to irrigate here also so in terms of production there is a lot of capacity and potential and farmers do produce actually but when it comes to marketing that's where the major problem is uh, they don't get um, um proper market link the price for the product is very very low like you have fertilizer labor you know all those costs um so i think the market issue is really a major challenge for establishment like this uh, this is what i've been investigating and uh, there are very interesting developments every time i come here so there are farmers already coming here to learn how how farmers ha- have been uh, collaborating building their institutions what challenges they have and all those kind of things. So I think it's uh, the right place to to do this kind of research. And it's uh, it's the first of its kind in Ethiopia also. So it has very significant implications in terms of generating uh, relevant uh, knowledge and understanding to the other schemes uh, that are upcoming.